wengine wakitulia so mr director unajua vile wanazanga naje Tu record juice na tenit. So guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Zach and this is my tech channel. So for today I had prepared to review the burner phone of which many people regard as the the Kadunda in Kenya that is the I think let's just say the nickname for Kadunda is for Kadu for burner phone is Kadunda and this is what we call a Kadunda a Kadunda is basically let's say just like a burner phone and in most of the times we use it for communication here in in Kenya and even in every every place across the world is from the Kaduda or let's just say the banner phone that we came up with this concept of androids and android applications and let's say basically the android operating system as a whole so the Kaduda or let's just say the banner phone is an idea that came up for let's say just very many years ago and let's say in a third world country like Kenya that is most people have embraced how to use this kalunda it is very cheap as you can see the phone is very cheap it's very cheap cheap looking no let me just not say cheap looking okay it's very cheap it has low storage low spot of which in a country let's say for now this 21st century a phone that has very minimal memory very minimal specs is not considered to be the best at this time so i want to welcome you to my channel and i hope that you'll be you'll be pleased with what i have for you today as i try and look into the kadunda of which is the banner phone and this banner phone of choice today is from the itel company as you can see the phone has very low specs the phone has zero let's just say very that one could say that it's not that good it has a 2 me megapixel camera but however for the people who famously use this this phone are between let's say 60 years and above for in Kenyan market and let's say just say that they appreciate it more than the regular smartphones that we have this today so as youths we tend to accept the fact that these are not just phones that we could go over and use as we please because for now we have cool phones we have good phones we have good samsung phones galaxy s series we have the redmi phones we have iphones so i would not think that someone will be able to buy the idea of buying a banner phone at this age unless what you have seen in movies for criminals probably so they don't they cannot be traced or something like that but i don't think the guys in kenya who have age bracket over 50 to 60 years need a Kaduda phone for basically for illegal acts but it's just a way it's just the phone that they found favorable to them and the phone that they prefer they are not so much familiar with the touch screen technology that is coming back although we have most people who embrace the technology more than this Kaduda phone it has five as you can see from this banner phone buttons that you can easily press and type in the numbers and then a call button and a cancel button all that's all you have a menu key those are just only the few memories that you have the phone also has uh, past technologies battery you can just pop up the back cover and remove your battery from removing your bat battery is when you can insert your sim sim 1 and sim 2 and you have a slot over there even for expanding your memory with your regular SD card so battery that you have you can see how it is there a past a past antique for past people I don't think people like my my future kids will be able to have a chance to see phones a technology that has seemed not to fade away people still embrace it because of their pricing I guess 
and their comfortability to use because I don't quite understand why someone could choose a regular burner phone over an Android phone because Android phones offer a platform of wide range of opportunities. I once asked an old man what he thought over the idea of using a smartphone and to him he felt that smartphones are too expensive. I don't know what you think. You can say your, com your, your, your thoughts down in the description down below. And if indeed you have people still using this phone, what do they, do they think of it? How do they perceive people who use smartphones? Will smartphones really work for them? Is it a thing for them? With the current state of apps, so many apps and developments that are meant to fasten our work towards this technological era, I think it's better for us to have a regular embrace in more smartphones, but just save these burner phones as an antique history of technology. It's just like how in computers we have learned from, we advanced from diskettes to CDs, CD players, to now we have flash drives, and to the SSD technology and something sort of that. So I prefer, for me basically, one from the 21st century, I totally and honestly prefer having a smartphone over a burner phone. But now, since for this video, it's a question I want to pose to you guys. Would you rather prefer a burner phone or an Android phone? If it's a burner phone, why would you prefer a burner phone? If it's an Android, however, why would you prefer the Android? Regardless of issues such as the price, would you still use a burner phone? I think that is something that will truly trigger your mind into and how technology has advanced through the years so it has a small display back to the phone no i think it's just because i'm used to having an, a smartphone that's why if i get in touch with a burner phone it will may not be that pleasing as how i will perceive to have a smartphone i've learned to impress in times when in kenya when you are robbed most people prefer to buy a burner phone maybe because it's cheap and getting another smartphone will have an experience a time of searching and searching for more money so that you can purchase a new phone but for the burner phone it's just like a one straight thing like when you stamp your fingers you can have one because they go for something sort of less than 1500 shillings you can get a burner phone but for a good smartphone a good smartphone basically ranges from a price range to 12,000 and above so I hope that you have enjoyed this video guys and thank you so much. I welcome you to the next video. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Catch you in the next video. Thank you.